All right, so we are at 5322 Thomas Circle. Uh, it's a very, very quiet neighborhood. Ba the whole neighborhood is basically this street over here and this street here. Um, this go in a, in a loop. It, it's back uh, hidden in a bunch of apartment complexes. Uh, we are in the medical center. So there's uh, a big appeal to the medical center. Um, for, for tenants, it's, it's easy to rent in this area. Um, you get a lot of, you know, young professionals, young doctors, interns, uh, a lot of, a lot of people in the medical professional profession. Um, it's still early on, on Friday morning and, um, I'm not the first person here. There was a show going on when I got here today. So, uh, single story, under 300 grand is, is just a hot house, uh, head on inside. Uh, I'm going to point out the front door it has issues. It's, it's solid, but it's ugly. There's some damage there on the bottom. Uh, so you can walk in long entrance down to the living room. There are two bedrooms and a bathroom here up to the front. We'll drop into bedroom number one, right in the front of the house. Uh, the the house here is it's clean, um, it's very perfumey. They uh, yeah they they spray. It doesn't have the. It doesn't. It doesn't smell bad at, at all. I don't. I don't want to imply that I think it does smell bad. So there's no bathtub in the in the the front bath. Um, that is a deterrent for some buyers, um, especially buyers of small children, because children like to take baths. Um, some have to take baths. Uh, show the closet. This is a smaller room with this wall being cut off. It's it's not as big as the other one. Um, It's a standard little closet. These are the front two bedrooms. We have a closet here to the left. Just a standard issue little coat closet. We walk into the dining area right here, adjacent to the kitchen. Uh, laminate as well. Cut into the laundry room from here. Another, that's gonna be your pantry. Then washer and dryer. Having the cabinet next to the washer and dryer is very convenient. I'm a fan of that. Air conditioner doesn't look bad. Let me see if I can quickly read a date. So it looks like it was manufactured in 2013. So this unit's about nine years old. Out into the, the two car garage. See the, that box on the wall right there? That is for the irrigation system in the front. This is the water softener and then the water heater. Electric water heater. All that looked good. Come through the kitchen. Look down the hall to the front door, then spin into the living room. Recessed lights. The floor looks new. It's it's nice. It's it's clean. And then we have the master bedroom. There's gonna be a little coat closet here.
Then you get your throne. It is not the brightest bathroom. Here you have a, a whirlpool, a jacuzzi gar uh, garden tub, not a, not a whirlpool tub. Stand up shower. And then a nice size walk in closet. Walk out and check out the backyard. That's a data wire. Walk around this way. It's got lots of side yard. Siding looks good. Backs to nothing. Lots of side yard over here too. Nice big oversized slab. The train unit. I don't remember what the inside unit was branded with. I imagine this one is this one is from December of 2013. So, all right. So this is five three two two. Thomas Circle.